All right, y'all, it's the next day, the next day, it's the next day. All right, y'all, man, I'm taking all, right now I'm taking all my bikes and shit like that. You know, I got, I got a bunch of bikes over here. I'm taking all that shit to the garage. You know, I got a bunch of space in the garage now. I got my garage back. I got my garage back. I didn't need to break these candles down. I haven't done it yet. Um only because we're trying to figure out alternatives. Instead of breaking it all the way down, take this, turn this into five by 10, and then have two five by 10. This all right here where I can put two dollars in there, AKA the boys, and then remove this and set this up against the water, you know, the fence and shit. Let me finish, uh, we finished putting the bikes in the front. And they're gonna get a little, once we move this little shit right here, we're gonna get us a little workout, man. Oh, we gotta clean these kennels out, y'all. What up, Lucy? When I throw the forces on, you know I mean business. When I throw the forces on, you know I mean business. Oh boy, straight to the fence. Straight to the fence. Bikes and shit from out the backyard. Bikes don't belong in the backyard. I think my garage is still open. Go back to the front. And leaving the garage open, y'all. You know, that's how we had the first problem with them just looking into my garage. What's going on in the garage? Yeah, it's my garage. Mm. But. Jump over this fence. We jump over that fence. You're not coming back. Gotta clean that dude. Y'all been seeing a lot of dookie. Um, I'm just in a lot of. A lot, of, a lot of pile of dookie, man. So we gotta go clean up. We gotta clean the garage up first. You know, clean up the back. We're gonna bring the boys back here and put them in those kennels over there.
That was clean. Yesterday, I put a bunch of hot water and bleach on top of it and let it sit. Cook. So I knew today that that would just rinse off real easy. That girl from the drop. All these puppies, I'm gonna tell y'all right now, these puppies are a real deal, okay? Clean up time, clean up time, clean up time. Right, so what we do for clean up? As far as my dog in the back crying, listen. I'm a master at this daddy stuff, man. I've been doing this shit for nine years. If you have a baby that's under two, to my the baby baby. Let they ass uh, cry, okay? If you don't let them cry, you're gonna deal with some problems later that you should have dealt with early on. Hey, mama. Hey, mama. Hey, mama. Hey, mama. What's wrong? What's wrong? You mad because you failed or what? Yeah, she I big now. Yeah, she failed. She ain't hurt herself. Y'all can tell, but we gotta clean my driveway is now that I don't got this set up no more. That was a terrible, terrible, terrible setup. Um terrible setup for uh for like a, a residential neighborhood, man. Cool setup for like a business and all that, but until I get the land and get that building put on my land, I'm no longer setting up those kennels like that again, ever.
So we got that space cleared up, cleaned up. Now that all this cleaned off, start using my gym more. More space over here. Once it's dry, it'll be clean. It's gonna be nice, bro. Start uh, start having fun in the backyard. Get the grass uh, cut up. I already went through and picked up all the poop. Probably 99, I just said 97% of the poop is cleaned up. Sometimes your eyes miss stuff because you be thinking as you walking and you might see something, but you don't, it doesn't register that you've seen Dookie. I don't know. It's kind of weird, bro, because I've already walked right across from Dookie to pick up some Dookie plenty of times. Mm -hmm. Cause your brain just be all over the place sometimes. That's how it go, y'all. Get to your weights organized. 10, 25, Clean this off. All right, y'all. What should I do with this? It's 10 by 10. 10 across, 10 that was a 10 by 10. Should I turn these into two five by tens like I had right there? Should I do standalone five by tens? I think, I think what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do four, maybe six, maybe six five by tens and line it up on, on the grass. So the only thing about this is when it rain, it floods over here, but I'm not gonna use it for like, I'm gonna try to say, I'm not going to use it to keep dogs in there. But like, whenever the dogs need playtime, I can just come out here, throw them in, and throw them in a little kennel, a little five by ten. They can just run up and down the kennel and shit like that. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. And then I have all this available. Um, all this available for entertainment. Put some chairs and stuff. I move this somehow. Thought about taking my gym back in the garage, but I'm not gonna do that right now, y'all. Um, what you doing, TT? But yeah, I got enough kennels to set up probably, I got enough kennels to set up eight five by tens, but I don't think I'm gonna need eight. I think I'm just gonna set up six five by tens just to have, when I take dogs out the garage, you know, walk them through the house, put them in the backyard, get, let them get a little exercise on the, on the setup like that, but. I'm thinking, y'all. At the end of the day, dogs still need yard time. Thinking, bro. I could just take all the kennels down Put them bitches all in, cause I'm a thing I take them all down, put them all in storage. And then, just take the dogs for walks, okay? I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take this down. I'm not, I'm not gonna put up what I just said I was gonna put up. I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna take this completely down. And whenever I get the dogs in the backyard, I'm just gonna be out here with them. I'm gonna run around, get some exercise. And after that, they ass going right back in the kennel. And as far as, you know, exercise outside of just being in the backyard, He's going to take them on more walks. I'm not doing a kennel set up on this property because I don't own this property. And they've already destroyed enough grass. This grass will grow back like you see it grow back over there. It will grow back. But if I set up the kennel how I just said I'm going to set it up, I would just put more, uh, put more pressure on the ground and that would take longer to heal. And um, like I said, it's not my ground. I don't own this property. Um, so I don't want to destroy this ground. So I've done enough and I know it's going to heal. The grass will heal because it, it's done it before. But I'm going to help it by taking this. I'm going to take this down. We're not going to do this no more. When she poops, she be like trying to cover it up. She's so funny, bro. All right, I'm going to take this down. Baby, Daddy, come here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, don't mess with it. Is that good on it? Mm-hmm. Get my baby outside, y'all. Getting fresh air. 
It's not hot, it's not cold, it's kind of in perfect temperature right now. It's real cloudy, sun ain't beaming down. So, I'm almost done knocking this down. Put some, um, I'm gonna put some bird food, some chicken food over here. I'm gonna run around here, pick this up, scrape this up. A bunch of birds gonna come in and they're gonna bring, they're gonna bring this dirt back to life. What up? It's what? I said it's Tenth Day. It's Monday. It's Tenth Day? It's the Tenth? No, Tenth Day. Hmm. I don't know. All right. So many kennels, y'all. Like, I don't know if y'all know that this is so many kennels. This is so much money, huh? Is this the water? Yeah, don't step in that. It's dirty water. It's bleach water. What is that? It's bleach and water. Kennels, these are roofs. These kennels right here. I need to break these down. I need to get some type of, I don't know, I got some type of bag where I can sit and put these in and organize these. They came in a box, they didn't come in a bag. So they would have came like a little bag or, you know what I'm saying? It'd be easy, but they came in a, bo a, a box. I know when we had a box. And when I move all these kennels, when I move all these kennels uh, to the building and all that, I won't even need these roofs anyway. And if I decide to, you know, build my kennels, I'll start on another concrete slab with a drain system and all that. I'm gonna get real roofs built because these roofs, you know what I'm saying? That ain't it. Get some real roofs built over everything. Not connected to the kennels, it'll be separate. What up, Ronnie? Ronnie, you outside now. So. I'm gonna go over there and pick up some more poop, make sure I got all the poop out. And that's just how we're doing it, man. You be careful, okay? Don't do that, baby. Why? Because it's dangerous. I'm just laying up a hurricane. You don't know that. What's up? Hmm. You outside getting fresh air? What's the deal? What you complaining about? Um, we're gonna start having fun in my backyard, doing stuff with the kids, doing more, more, inviting more people over. Um, I'm gonna go into my social era of life, so I'm gonna get some a picnic table and all that out here. Do a whole good nine. We're gonna be out here grilling, barbecuing, drinking, having a good time. And clean all this up, man. The dogs are only gonna come back here for a little bit to play, and I'm gonna take them on walks. But this is no longer, you know, for the dogs. All this stuff, all the dog houses and all the kennels, I will be putting that in storage very soon. I'm putting all this in storage, all this in storage, man. None of this is for sale. I'm going to use every bit of this, everything I'm going to use. I may not use the roots again, but I'm still gonna keep them just in case. But yeah, man, make sure you like, come subscribe, catch you on this video. This is a very special week. We have day 51 for Hazel. As y'all know, from 55 to 60, they're, they're coming. So four days, like four days, they're coming. And today is Monday the 10th. Um, thank y'all, man. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'm gonna go in and um, see my daughter, man. She need a nap, it's nap time. All right, y'all, I love y'all. Really appreciate everybody. Make sure you uh, share the video with friends. Got any questions, leave in the comment section. How many puppies y'all think Rossi gonna have? How many puppies you think Hazel gonna have? The winner of whoever um, get the number right will get a hundred dollar cash out. So make sure you uh you put it in the comment section. I'm paying attention. I'm, I'm looking. I'm, I'm observing. If I see editing on there, I'm not even gonna I'm not I'm not gonna pay attention to that comment no more. Um, all your comments are locked in. I'm paying attention. I see everything. How many Hazel gonna have y'all? Hundred dollar cash out.